The representative of Lagos Central Senatorial District, Nigerian Youth Parliament, Abdul Mumin Edidi, has organized an annual hangout for the youths to socialize in sporting activities and also sensitize them on their rights to vote. The event, which was tagged Catch the Vibe, which attracted youths of voting age, also had INEC heads of unit Lagos in attendance. Our correspondent Paul George reports. Over 500 young men and women gather at this event tagged Catch the Vibe, which means vision, information, benefits and experience. For many of them, it is a moment to network and also catch a glimpse of the activities Why some have come out to participate in various sporting games. The convener, Abdumumin Edidi, tells us why it's important to have this event at this time. The idea is to bring young people together in a social sport, non-competitive atmosphere um, to get the vision of the youth parliament, get informed on things going on that affect young people in the society, engage and tap the benefits that is available and create a wonderful experience for ourselves. Look at the environment, you find out that the spaces are still scanty. That's because one of the criteria for being getting access into this venue is to show your permanent voters INEC Head of Unit, Lagos, expresses disappointment in the low turnout of youths at the PVC collection centers in the southwest. He urges them to go out and get their PVCs. Some of the market women have told us right, that, look, they can't leave you know, their wares to go and collect you know, that they will be there till evening. I said, is that what is important to you now? Right? And some will tell you, eh, I want to go and do this, I want to go and do that. So that is, you know, and apart from that, some, eh, you know, eh, it's already this place, it's already filled with so, so, so party members. So it is of no use. Not, you know, we are not, you know, eh, in the time of trading blames and, uh, you know, go out and get your PVC. And any hindrance, give, it, give us a call. Other members of the organizing committee explain what the youths stand to gain if they participate in the election process. They speak alongside an electorate who expresses delight at joining the youths at the event. The network, then secondly, they'll be able to uh, uh, get sensitization because we have a uh, representative from INEC coming. So we'll get sensitization about the upcoming election. And also, if they have any question ranging from non-availability non, uh, of PVC, I don't know my word, and all those stuff, they'll be able to uh, uh, ask directly from the INEC staff. Based on the name of our group, that is um, Lagos Central Centorial District, Lagos Central Youth Constituency. So what we do is we, we train ourselves um, to be good leaders. So those that have the interest of youth in mind, that have also tried their best to support the youth, so some of them will be here today. When you see a set of young people come together to say they're hanging out, you know, they're playing sports, they're talking politics, they're doing a drive to get people to get their PVCs, they're not even insisting on you voting on a particular candidate, they're just saying that the youth should get involved. And this is what we've always said, we want the youth to get involved, so when they're doing this, why don't we support them? You know, it, it, it's a no-brainer, you, you have to support them. As the countdown to election gets closer, the electorate can only hope that PVC collection will be seamless. Paul George, Plus TV News.